One in every 500 newborn babies in the Philippines has a cleft palate. The condition affects speech development and the child's well-being. While surgery can have dramatic effects on a patient, costs are highly prohibitive. So one company decided to fund this program so a child born with a cleft palate can have a bigger reason to smile. Joining us on Goodwill is the Chief Transformation Officer of Asia United Bank, Jacob Nang. Jacob, thanks for joining us. Uh, good morning. Thank you for having me. Now, as a bank, you actually have the vantage point of looking at different causes, and yet you chose this partnership with Operation Smile. Tell mm -hmm. us what are the reasons behind this. Well, it's it's uh, it's actually very move. It's it was very moving for us. Um, it seems simple, you know, cleft palate. It's not life threatening. It's not like we're cure curing cancer, but it makes such a big difference in their lives. Before this, they, the the kids couldn't go to school. They would they would be ostracized from the community. But after this, you can see there's a bounce in their step. They can get a decent education, and from there they can get a they can get a job, and they can uplift themselves. Now you're just looking at this as an enabling intervention for yes. the, for a child's future. But let's look <clears throat> at the numbers. For example, you talked about one out of five. But the question is, has this condition actually persisted over time, and how does AUB intend to lower the cases and improve lives along the way? Well, it's um, it's all about numbers, actually. I think there's a backlog of about. Uh, 80, 80 to 100,000 cleft palate cases here in the Philippines. So we're trying to do our part. Um, we've already helped about approximately about 400, um, 400 uh, patients over time. I know it's just a drop in the bucket, but then you know, every, everyone counts. It's a symbolic gesture as well because you've got a long-standing partner here. Operation Smile has been doing this for decades. And yes. the question I have is, what in this partnership model works for you that other corporations and institutions can look at as a model for developing? Well, this one, we're, you know, we're a bank. We, we don't uh, pretend to be experts in the field, so we tied up with someone who was really knowledgeable. So they've been, as, as you said, they've been doing this for decades, and then they have set up an excellent infrastructure. They have a, they have a good lineup of doctors and uh, facilities. So we just sit back, we just give them what they need, and and then let them do their thing. And we also provide them with volunteers to help them with the day-to-day -day, uh, needs of the of their missions. Okay, so this is a complimentary pitching and a template yes. for corporate responsibility in the Philippines. Now, we have a video of one of, of a couple of your beneficiaries, the sisters, the, uh, the Hulaton sisters, Jeline and Andrea mm -hmm. from Cavite. Can you tell us more about them? What makes them special and how in this symbol has uh, have lives changed? Well, this one, it's a special case because these are two kids uh, from the same family. So the, fa the, the parents were like thinking that they were uh, especially devastated. They were thinking, why, why did they, why did, what did they do to deserve such, such a situation? But then through, a, and then it, as you can see, through a simple operation, it takes 45 minutes, and you can see that literally that the li their lives would change. They, they can smile, and then they can, uh, they can, they're now, they're, they've now started to go to school, and uh, I think the younger one is also hoping to do the same next year. So, and then you can see that the parents now have a, now that they can see that their kids have a future, they themselves feel that much better. And Jacob, there's nothing like a U.S. interest story, but to expand this takes a little more resources and coordination. What are your future plans for Operation Smiles partnership with you and for this cause? Um, well, we, in addition to continuing what we do now, we give an annual donation and we also provide volunteers. But we also plan to tap our existing clients to see if there are synergies with Operation Smile, to see if we can provide them with uh, maybe with more um, with medicines and uh, and other and other things that they might need in the future. Jacob, thank you so much for sharing these insights and your generosity. Look forward to the success of this program. Thank you.